A simple dirt road that separated two farms became etched in American history on the morning of September 17, 1862. The Battle of Antietam is known as the bloodiest single day in American history, and Bloody Lane played a large part of that. The battle around Bloody Lane stretched across two open fields with no cover. Soldiers marched through cannonade and gunfire, only to be repulsed halfway through. The sloped area of Bloody Lane acted as a rifle pit for the center of the Confederate line. They were to hold the ground at all costs. Through the morning, the Union troops attempted to take the rebel position a multitude of times, failing on each. Finally, with the body count adding up, the Federals made one last attempt, this time with the fabled Irish Brigade. The hardened Irish Brigade, 69th of New York, joined the fight with their battle cry of Fa a Bala, clear the way in Gaelic, and helped work the Union forces to point overlooking the rifle pit where they could fire down on the helpless Southerners. Unfortunately for the Irish Brigade, they lost nearly 65% of their unit in that single battle. Some Union soldiers later considered this shooting fish in a barrel and others like firing on animals in a pen. Regardless of the metaphor, the soldiers tore into the Confederates, stacking up bodies four and five feet deep in some spots. The sunken road is reported as one of the strangest locations in the battlefield. Gunfire and cannons have been heard coming from nowhere with no reenactors in the area. Odd smells of smoke and gunpowder have been reported while visitors walk along the road. Some people have even reported seeing Confederate-looking soldiers walking across the open field toward the road only to vanish upon reaching Bloody Lane. One of the most memorable stories is that of a school field trip where the students claimed to hear the sounds of a Christmas song, but upon hearing this tale, their teacher began thinking that they may have heard the phantom cries of the Irish brigades Fa'a Bala still clearing the way from the grave.